gets things running. So what now? Battles to win it back. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Dybala, now it's Messi. Now it's Di Maria. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. Forward it goes. Looking to break out here. Played out to the right. Gets it back. And it's Dybala. Well, the fact that we haven't had an attempt on goal is becoming a, an embarrassing reflection on these teams. Argentina in front! Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Argentina take the lead. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to say from up here, I know. to get it forward quickly with a delicate ball Dybala Messi puts his foot on the gas aimed low and direct To the keeper and go again. So they got the only goal to make it 1 0. There is the half time whistle. And there we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, that certainly pleased the fans, and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now, can they protect it? Argentina come in, having established that lead. A game where the narrative is, at least in terms of the scoreline, so far so good. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Argentina carry a one-goal lead into the second half. Good ball, striding forward, facing goal. A chance! Turns and goes back, he's had a shot! This could fall anywhere! Well, it's good stuff, this is better. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this, it really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. There's no flag. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Now it's Messi. Di Maria passes it through. Tries a through ball. It's a brilliant interception. It's a loose ball. It's one! In it goes! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. There's the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Argentina get themselves a two-goal cushion. 
Well, at 1 0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing. Massive leap! It's in! Back to within one! Interesting! Great header, made it look easy. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they've done so well to get back in it, but it's important now that they don't become over-eager in chasing another. They only need one more chance. Patience is key. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Hits it! Looking for support. And time is up. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. 1-1, one, one, drawn one, four points from six, and looking good. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Argentina were totally organised, disciplined and professional here throughout.